Did you know that Blender deletes some of your materials without any warnings? Let me show you. Okay, so we have this scene with two cubes. And when we go to our material drop down here, we can see that we have two materials in the scene, green and orange. So I'm going to select the green cube and assign the orange material. Save my scene. Create a new scene which closes our cube scene and open our cube scene again. So now I changed my mind and I want to make this cube green again. So I select the cube, go to the material drop down, and as you can see, the green material is now gone, even though we just saved our scene. So what happened here? Let's go back in time to find out. This is the moment we saved our scene. If you have a look at the outliner here, you will see that we only have two objects in the scene, cube one and cube two. And when we saved the scene, both of these objects were using the orange material, meaning we had no objects in our scene using the green material. And Blender has an automatic cleanup feature. It will not save any materials that are not assigned to any objects. Or in Blender terms, it will not save any materials that have zero users. So what can we do about this? Let's have a look at this scene. Next to the material name, there is this shield icon. Once you click it, this material is now protected from deletion. It will be saved no matter what. Or in Blender terms, it is now assigned to a fake user. You can see this under the material dropdown. Next to the material name, you have an F. F for fake user. So that's fine. But how can I tell if I have materials in my scene that are not assigned to any objects? Let's try it out. I'm going to make this red cube orange. So now I do not have any objects in my scene that are using the red material. Under my material dropdown, we can see that next to the material's name, there is now a zero. Blender is letting us know this material has zero users. It will not be saved with our scene. So let's do a little recap. I'm going to make all the objects orange. And let's have a look at our material dropdown. The green material is not assigned to any objects, but it has an F next to its name, meaning it is assigned to a fake user. It will be saved with our scene. The orange material has nothing next to its name, meaning it is assigned to at least one object. It will be saved with our scene. The red material has a zero next to its name, meaning it has no users. It will not be saved with our scene. I'm going to save the scene. Create a new scene, which closes our cube scene, and open our cube scene again. And as you can see, the red material is now gone, and the green material, even though it was not assigned to any objects, is still available for us to use. So that is something to keep in mind if you have materials in your scene that are not assigned to any objects, but you plan to use them later. All right, I hope this video was useful. I have more videos coming where I will share with you the things that I found to be confusing as a beginner in Blender to try and help you on your Blender learning journey. Let me know in the comments what you find to be confusing. I am Karim Joseph for Blender Daily and I'll see you in the next video.